My name is Ron Drescher. I'm an attorney practicing bankruptcy and creditor's rights in Maryland, Delaware, Pennsylvania, and Virginia. And today I want to answer the question, how much is my Chapter 13 payment going to be? I've answered that question in a couple of different ways, in a couple of different videos, but there's a third consideration that we, we have to address, and that is, do you have priority claims against you? because priority claims are going to need to be paid in full over the life of your Chapter 13 plan. Now, the most common priority claim that you're gonna see in your Chapter 13 case will be taxes that you haven't paid that are due for the last, usually three years before you filed your case. Those have to be paid in full at the statutory interest rate. Right now, that's about 6%, although that could change. Uh, over the life of your plan. So that means if you don't have to pay anything else, if your net disposable income is zero based upon the different formula that I've discussed in other videos, and if you have no equity in your property, but you wanna pay these taxes off because the IRS isn't playing ball with you, then you're gonna have to be able to do that over 36 to 60 months depending upon your income. Now another priority debt is frequently if you have a an unpaid domestic support obligation. That is also entitled to priority status. And that's also going to need to be paid in full in your Chapter 13 case. My name is Ron Drescher. I'm an attorney practicing bankruptcy and creditor's rights. And if you've got a priority claim and you want to know how that's going to affect your Chapter 13 payment, please pick up the phone and call me. I would love to hear from you.